This is part of the larval fish collection. We have over a million larval fishes here at the Australian Museum. Tiny baby little guys. Jeff Lease is the researcher that's been here for many years and has done a huge amount of work on this collection. He's published books and many, many papers. He's found out that these larval fish, in fact, aren't just drifting in the current. They're very, very strong, active swimmers and they know exactly where they're going, which of course has big implications, management implications for sighting par marine parks and all kinds of things. Larval fishes often look remarkably different to the adult. They live in different places, they eat different things, they have different requirements, they swim differently. Let's just take a flounder. The adult is flat, lying on the ground, we're all familiar with that, lying on the plate, covered in sauce, eyes looking up at you. The little baby ones actually swim like a normal fish with eyes on either side of their head and as they grow the eyes migrate either one way or the other. And in fact in some groups there's actually the snout grows forward, leaves a hole in the head, the eye goes through the hole, then the eye closes. That's the kind of thing we can find out about by using larval fishes.